Hello class, good morning. Today, we will be talking about Microsoft OneNote. Okay, let's start. Let's go to office.com. Okay, so since we've been logging into our Microsoft accounts, all you have to do is type O and it will automatically appear. Okay, so just I would just like to remind everybody to use their SJCS, SJCS Microsoft accounts, not the Gmail accounts or not the Google accounts, okay? Because the Google accounts, yung di ba kunyari ana.twason at sgcs.edu.ph ano yon google account so it it is not a premium account sa ating microsoft accounts so in our microsoft accounts it should be ana me is ana margarita.twason at sgcsmanila.edu.ph i think two of you here in this batch is still using google i have already um message them and i hope by this time uh, they will use the SACS manila accounts okay because that is a premium account at this point if you are still using the google account to log in here there might be some functions that are not available for you and you will not be able to to do the activity no the the whole activity because there are some functions that will not be available for you okay so yeah so once you are already logged in to your office 365 accounts you will see your uh, mga re recent uh, activities okay then you will go to the left side here you will see all the applications in Microsoft and I want you to go ahead and click one note so it is color violet so please click on that then okay so what is Microsoft OneNote Microsoft OneNote is a digital note-taking tool that will help you create notes and add content to them you don't worry because all of them are also automatically saved in the cloud. So whenever you need them, you need to access them, they are easily available in your Office 365 accounts. Okay, you can organize your notes, you can highlight them, draw them, you can add an audio, you can dictate. There are a lot of things that you can do in OneNote and it is really very good or uh, you can utilize this, especially now that we are doing RLP or the remote learning program wherein most of your notes will be sent to you by via PowerPoint or um, digitally. You know? Sometimes uh, it is, there are students who, who really wants to jot down notes or you want to highlight, they really want to underline special or important points or details about the notes so you can do that here okay you can directly write on your powerpoints and um, you can easily save them in one place like here in one note okay then it can also help you organize your notes you can also print them if you want to. So there are a lot of things that you can do here. So let us now start exploring Microsoft OneNote. So let's have, let's now, so these are my, uh, the notebooks that I have already created, but if you don't have yet, it's okay. Okay, so let us start OneNote, click on the plus new notebook. Then it will ask you to give a name or a title to your notebook. So I want you to think of a, a topic or a subject that you want uh, to use for this. Okay, for my demonstration for today, I will be using science. So uh, I will use this as my science notebook. Ayaw niya. Or English notebook. Ah, kasi gumawa na ako kanina eh, prior to this nag-practice ako. So, kung ayaw niya naman ngayon, okay. Hmm. 
Nagay ko na lang my notes. Science. But sa inyo, you can do science notebook, English notebook, okay? Sa akin, iniba ko lang para kasi na ayaw na ni Microsoft, okay? So, I will create my notebook. Ayan. So, sab sabi niya dito, this notebook is empty. Click here to press enter or press enter to create a new section. So, the... So, this is my, the title of my notebook, my, sci, my notes, science. And I will click on this to add a section. So, example, this is lesson one or introduction. You can also type here like yung mga sub topics na ninyo that are, you are really using now in your classes, okay? Or during the first quarter. Ayan. Then... I will now put a title on my, ano, uh, on this one. Mm. This will be the, like, parts of the body, example. Or the galaxy. The solar system. Yeah. Okay, so... You can also change the color. How? Click on this. Tayo, mamaya tayo mag-change ng color. Okay, so dito mo tayo. Do, so the title of my, you can also do bold here. And uh, change the color. You can also do that. Then, now I will add, first step is, or first task that I want you to do is add an audio. So, you will click on the insert audio. So, here, if you add an audio, it's like you're recording your own voice. This is also, this is, um, can be used for your Chinese, for your English class, or Filipino oral test, or... Some topics that you want to just record your voice. So, yan. I want you to add an audio um, recording here at this point. Okay? So, hindi naman masyado matagal. Like, 10 seconds will do. So, I will go ahead and click on this audio. You will see the red dot or the red um, color here. So, I will click on that. Okay. This is now recording. This... Audio recording is very important. This is necessary for my review. And um, I want to remember this because this will be part of the periodical exam. Okay. Then you click on the stop. Yeah. Okay. So, right now, so naka-record na dyan yung voice ninyo. So, I you will click on this. Okay, this is now recording. This audio recording is very important. This is necessary for my review. And um, I want to remember this because this will be part of the periodical exam. Okay, then you click on the stop. Okay, diba? So that's, that's how you do the audio recording. Next is insert a file printout. Do you know that you can actually insert a PowerPoint or a PDF or a Word file here in this note? And then after that, you can already highlight, underline, or do drawings on it. So let us do that. So I will now insert again a file. Insert file printout. This will allow a file. It's like it's going to be printed out here on your notebook digitally. So, insert file, print out. Then, I will choose the file. I have already um, saved some here. So, my solar system PowerPoint. So, let me just yeah, then insert. Okay. Now, it is inserting the PowerPoint. 
Okay, so now my PowerPoint is printed here in my notebook. Ayan. Then, of course, you can um, scroll to the first part. Okay, then okay, let us wait for it to load. Okay, for example, this is uh, the first page, no? but I want to start highlighting on this part. So, how do you highlight? Insert or home. Go to home. You can see here, oh, my highlight. Okay, example, I want to use itong, yan. Oh, well, yan, kunyari, highlight ko siya. Wait. Draw pala. You go to draw and you get a pen. So, sige. Sige, akit ko lang ha. For example, ito. I want to highlight this because I want to remember that Saturn is the second largest planet in the solar system. Ayan. I will get a pen and use this. So, yan, second largest planet in the solar system. I want to highlight that. And I want, I can change the ink color. I want pink one. Oh, yan, the solar system. Miss mm. Twasson, so I can really draw on it? Yes, po. You can also type. Mag-add ka dyan. You can also erase, okay, pen, pwede mo rin pakapalin yung sulat, okay, yan, blue naman, ayan, Saturn, largest rings, ba? So, yan, you can do many things in your notes. Gusto ko pa mas makapal para intense. Okay, yan. Okay. So, you can do that. Okay? So, yan. After that, you insert a file, print out PPT. You can also do uh, Word. Word naman. So, mag-add tayo dito. So, once you're done with this part, no, you can insert, oh wait, and back, 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 pwede mo mag back. We can add a new page, add a page, okay, same lesson one, but you, know, you want to have a new page, hello. Let's wait because it's, nakikita nyo yan, it is loading. Maghintay tayo, mag-load yun. So, ibig sabihin na save na siya sa OneDrive natin. So, we can now type na ulit tayo here. So, kunyari ito naman, human heart. So, erase lang natin to. Ayan, human heart. Then, I will upload a, ano naman, word file. So, how do you do that? Wait lang kasi it's loading again. You have to wait for that. You cannot click anything if it's still loading. By the way, what I'm showing you is the web version. There is also, for all the Windows users, you there's in, built in one note in your ano, accounts, okay? In your laptops, you can do that as well. I'm just doing this um, web version para everyone will have the web version regardless of what device they're using, iba? Okay. Delete. 
matagal siya mag-sync eh. Hindi lumalabas yung mga ibang... Yeah. Okay, you can also change the page color. Nakikita nyo, pale lang yan because, yan, yan, pink. Tagal niya mag-load. Ayun. I-refresh natin. Ayan. Para. Ayan na. So, pwede na tayo ulit mag-insert. Pag gano'n nangyayari, Miss Susan, I cannot do anything else. Nag, nag uh, ano to. So, mag, ano po tayo. Refresh lang tayo. Okay. So, we can also add a file again. Uh, insert file print out. I will now add naman a Word document. Human heart sa human heart notes. Ayan. So, if this is the human heart, so again, you can draw on it. Okay. For your review. So, pwede kang so thickness natin, babaan natin. Ayan, then, pink pa rin. So, pwede mo sabihin, ah, oh, okay, this is the left pulmonary vein. Sulitan pa natin, nipisan lang natin. Oh, okay, so this is the part. This is it. Okay, you can highlight that. You can highlight it pink or yellow. Okay, then, then you can draw on it. You can, um, oh, so this is, you can insert your notes here. You can do that. Change color. Okay. Ah, so, Miss Tuasan, we can really, um, write on it and do something about our notes so that it will be, um, better for us when we review them. Yes po. Okay. So, for this activity, yun po yung gagawin natin. You will make a new notebook. You will add a PowerPoint, an audio muna, an audio file. You will insert a file print out, PPT, then edit it. Then you also insert the word, then edit them. Okay? Don't worry kasi I will make a, a PowerPoint ng lahat ng requirements for this activity number one, second quarter. So, after that, you will share that with me. So, ano yung mga requirements ulit? Mag-screenshot ulit po tayo. Dali, di ko mahanap yung sa gilid ko ah. So, click nyo yun dito. Lalabas yung yung profile pic ulit, yun sa side. Ha? Picture nyo yun. Ito, makikita ko yan. Then, you will share the file with me. Ito oh. How do you do that? How do you share? File. Share. Share with people. Ayan. Tapos, ano, Huwag nyo type dito yung pangalan ko. Gusto ko, I want you to just copy the link. Ayan, copy. Copy the link. Kunyari, then ipopaste nyo sa Schoology natin. So, for example, tingnan mo kung check first if it's working yung link. Control V. So, when once I open your the link, makikita ko kung talagang ginawa mo. Diba? Makikita ko yung pag-edit, pag ano mo, ha? So, that is the requirement for this subject or for this activity number one. That's all for today. I hope you learned something from this, from this demonstration. Goodbye and thank you.